All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm back again with another little tutorial on how to, um, you know, how to make your, your cleaning products awesome. I've got this little jar here. Um, it's just a little baking soda, so nothing, nothing harsh, nothing crazy, but a little baking soda um, and some various essential oils to make it smell all good. Bam. Um, and so I've got these all set up and put together, you know, um, ready for you. Cool part is I'm going to show you actually how to put the holes in the can. So that's why I'm redoing this video. If you've already seen it, I apologize for a second one, but stay tuned. All right, ladies and gentlemen, just so you know, this is really simple, real easy to make. It takes just a few small ingredients. Okay. So you've got your hammer right here. See that little booger? Okay. Got your mason jar. Everybody's got them. They're cheap and easy. Five dollars for like a pack of nine or twelve or however many they come in. But really cheap, easy to find, and versatile because you can drink out of them, you can can them, you can blah blah blah. Okay. You got your essential oils. To go with your hammer, you need a little screw or uh, anything really <laughs> that pokes that can get hit with a hammer. Um, some baking soda. Bam. Um, and I've tried to mark out the, um, if you can tell, there, there we go. We're not branded. All right. <clears throat> um, so we've got that. Um, and easy enough. All we have to do is take the jar, open it up. All right. Could get a little messy. What I like to do, fill it about halfway. a little more whatever all right then they say about 10 to 15 drops of each I'm not gonna tell you what's in here cuz I am in love with these two smells that's enough for that Then of course, you gotta have a tea tree oil. There we go. That's a good chunk. All right. Now, what I like to do, take the screw, stir it up a bit. So it's gonna get thick in there, so you're gonna have to go back in and stir it up to break it up. I was like, shake it. I was like, shake it. I was like, shake it. Shake it. Okay, Freshening up that carpet, y'all. Yeah, yeah. Not here. <laughs> There you go. Pretty solid right there. All right. So now I've got it all mixed up. I turn it into a shaker. I'll speed up the process here. And there you go. Now you have your shaker. You're about ready to go. You'll be able to mix it up with a, any kind of knife or whatever, you know, blah, blah, blah. It's gonna break down a little bit so then you can put a little bit more baking, baking soda in there. Um, and yeah, there you go. You put that on your carpet after you sprayed it down with a little um, warm vinegar. So I actually have a bottle that I've been using lately. Um, Turns your room into a uh, pretty smelly place for a little while, but it clears everything up really nicely. And, um, yeah, clears it up really nicely. And um, once you add this, your, your house is smelling great. Oh, oh, see, there you go. Works perfectly. All right, you guys have a good day. 
Appreciate you guys for watching. Hope it helps something out, you know, while we're all quarantined and stuck in the house. Um, yeah. yeah. I'll see you guys soon, you know, over here in the internet world. Over and out.